Hello to your beautiful faces. I am actually just going to change the colour of my light on my beautiful face uh, to match the lovely summer glow of Motel Cinderella. Uh, you may be able to tell we've had a bit of an update. Oh yeah. <laughs> my neighbours are getting a new gate, so there's drill noises. <laughs> I feel like they might be able to also hear me, which is awkward. Um, but also, uh, thank you to EA Game Changers for providing me with a code for Dream Home Decorator. So let's just get rid of that watermark. And you can see here, lovely Boney M. Uh, I've forgotten his actual name. Um, the Temple Guardian is, uh, he's just enjoying the new vibes down at Motel Cinderella because you may be able to tell we've had a little bit of a renovation. Now, some of you may remember in the last episode where I, oh, hello, look at this gorgeous cobblestone floor that we now have. Um, in the last episode, look at, look at it, guys, I'm excited. In, guys, in the last episode, we actually, um, we, we were doing the Dream Home Decorator gigs and we went to, um, somebody's house who turned out to be a mob boss and we tried to troll him by putting a bowling lane and four pipe organs in his house but he actually surprisingly loved it so um he's our best friend now and he said you know cinderella i've heard that your motel is a bit of a dump which i thought was quite rude but also honest um do you want us to come and uh and uh invest some money on renovating the business and you know no questions asked kind of thing. So I, I was like, yeah, you know, that sounds great. What do you mean laundering? Uh, I just kind of ignored that. I, I just, I thought he wanted to use my washing machine, which I don't think I actually have. I probably need to get one of those. So uh, yeah, I went for it. I went for it. I said, yeah, that sounds amazing. Uh, so yeah, he invested 50,000 simoleons. He mother loaded us. Um, and yeah, we've had a, a bit of an upgrade here. So check this out. <laughs> I'm very quiet outside. I feel like they're listening to me. They're thinking she's insane, and I am. So, um, don't tell them that I actually am. So, uh, yeah, so the, the mob boss, he did say, uh, you know, you're gonna owe me a favor, which again, like the laundry thing, I just I just kind of ignored that. I just thought, yeah, sure, whatever, mate, just give me the money, give me the effing money. So, here you go, here is the reception area, which you can see is considerably fancier than it was before. I think it looks amazing. I like Journey to Batu, I think it has cool objects, hate me. Um, so, yeah, <laughs> I love it shut up so uh yeah anyway <laughs> on that note a complimentary uh fizzy juice here you know if you're not if the uh the bizarre juice doesn't work for you and of course over here the hotel is endorsed by our uh, celebrity guest thorn bailey he did actually visit us once he, d he didn't stay he, he went into a room where we locked him in for a bit and then and then i let him go but that counts so you know <laughs> Oh my, it looks so good, guys. Guys, get Dream Home Decorator. Like, even if you're not into, like, the game, you know, the gameplay element, of which I think there is gameplay. <laughs> Hate me. Um, you know, it's it gives you really gorgeous stuff. So some of it's Dream Home Decorator, and some of it's, I think, actually, do you know what? I don't think it is Dream Home Decorator in this room. Um, these chairs all come from Get Famous, which, again, is a pack that I really, really like. Uh, this... <laughs> This little pigeonhole thing which I thought I was really clever doing like you know the place where you put the keys and you put the mail for each room I thought I was really clever doing that that's those little cubes from dream home decorator so <laughs> big brain let's have a look in the bar area so if we go through here <laughs> right into the back of presumably Cinderella's head. Yep, yeah, there she is. <laughs> Say hi. Her big fat head getting in the way. So look at this. Lana Del Rey would love to perform here. Tell me she wouldn't. She'd like <laughs> Yeah, I was like, what would that the my aesthetic is Lana Del Rey, 70s, once upon a time in Hollywood, LA Confidential. There's going to be murders in this hotel now. This is the vibe I'm going for. So, uh, yeah, it's it's a bit of a lounge in here now. I, again, pretty impressed with myself. These sexy sectional sofas are indeed from Dream Home Decorator, as is this, as is not the fish tank table, which I love. I, that's from that uh, <laughs> The other popular pack, the other very popular pack that EA did, which was my first pet store. 
they got sick of listening to me so they're drilling again now i hope that's not too annoying for you all so uh yeah i i, I am impressed with myself this bar is not from dream home decorator i promise i'll use the pack at some point okay the bar is from um <laughs> patio perfect patio stuff <laughs> but look at this i am pretty there's look i did there's cabinets are from Dream Home Decorator. I do like the pack, right? I just I combined it with other things. I'm gonna have to shut the window, aren't I? Hang on, hang on, guys. Just look at, look, just look at Cinderella for a second. Look, look, look. Just feast your eyes. On that side. This means though, now I've shut the window, I'm gonna get extremely sweaty. <laughs> but we like it hot and sweaty at Motel Cinderella. Um, yeah, it's it's very warm and very humid here in the UK. And I had my COVID jab, which sent my temperature flying. <laughs> so I've been in my bed. Imagine me in bed, sweaty <laughs> for the entire past day and a half. Uh, so I've actually I've washed myself at this point, but I'm immediately sweaty again. I don't know why I bothered. Uh, too much information, Cinderella. <laughs> We share information here at Motel Cinderella. Oh my god, it's chaos. No, where have I gone? <laughs> I've gone the wrong way. Oh. So you may have had a bit of a peek at the rooms there. <laughs> just, just don't worry about that. You didn't see anything. So yeah, it's, it's a nice place to come and stay. It's a nice place to hang out. Um, you know, Motel, Motel Cinderella now, I feel, is a place where, you know, you can, you can, you can come. But you probably don't want to, to stay. You probably do want to leave because, yeah, the money didn't go far enough. I actually, I got bored of decorating. Right, okay, let's go outside. So look at this pool area. Tell me you wouldn't come and have a few cocktails here. A few bizarre fruit juices here. Like, isn't that such an improvement? Look at that. Those, I love those perfect patio sofas. If you're going to get a stuff pack, if you don't have many packs and you want a stuff pack, um, I really like perfect patio. Like I say, like you get that, you get, oh, hello. <laughs> you get this, this like nice bar set. Those chairs I think are from Dream Home Decorator. Um, those are from Bowling Night. <laughs> um, yeah, so I, I really, I really, I use perfect patio a lot. Uh, I think it's a bit of an underrated pack to be honest. Uh, so yeah, you can come out, you can float around here. You can chill on a, a towel. You can lie on a lounger, all the good stuff. You can dive and splash everybody and get them annoyed. Uh, don't splash the mob boss, I don't recommend that. Um, I've still got some of the uh, the goodies around the corner here, a bit of food on the floor that it wouldn't let me delete. So I just like, I just put it in the general bin area. Uh, <laughs> Hello, Gaidri, Gaidri. Are you okay? <laughs> Gaidri, you creep. <laughs> he's just waiting for Cinderella to come round and put something in the bins and then he's going to have her, um, <laughs> which she's going to enjoy. And uh, yeah, so it's it's nice. Uh, so yeah, if you do get Perfect Patio as well. Again, I'm not being paid to promote Perfect Patio today. I just genuinely enjoy it in my game. Um, and uh, it's something that I use a lot and maybe you'll enjoy too. So yeah, we've got these like palm trees and these tropical plants. You know, we've had the groundwork done. It's looking pretty amazing. If I do say so myself, design skills. Wait, I've got no hair on that side. <laughs> design, I've got <laughs> design skills. Ah, uh, design skills. Ah. Uh. <laughs> I've been ill for a day, guys. I'm giddy that I'm alive again. I'm not that alive though. I tried to do some yoga and I was very achy and very hot very quickly. So I feel better until I try to move or do anything and then I just get ill again. So this is. Oh, he's here, look, as well. He's just standing ready. I didn't set that up. He's just, he just happens to be there. So this is Knox's little a science experiment area. You can see we haven't quite given up on the mother. Um, and uh, yeah, look at all this. And I thought, do you know what? We've got some interesting, quirky characters here at Motel Cinderella. Um, and I thought, why not add another another scary Halloween-themed guest? We've got ghosts. We've got... <laughs> skeletons why not add a pumpkin man as well because you, you know what you're getting here so yeah that is uh, most of the makeover that's like as far as i've kind of got um however uh the rooms are the rooms are not great i've kind of done the doors on the ground floor but yeah the rooms are still yeah it's still a bit grim upstairs <laughs> you may have seen i posted a picture of bone hilda and cinderella hoovering <laughs> downstairs but listen listen 
We'll get them drunk, they won't even notice. They won't care where they crashed. They'll wake up in the morning like, what is that on the floor? Ugh. <laughs> Gaitry juice, why? Um, so yeah, like uh, the rooms still need doing. I basically, I've only got so much tolerance for decorating in one one go. I got bored, <laughs> so I did. I did the public area. The, the private areas are just uh, this. The, the, they're still in disrepair. So do you know what I need to do? I need to get a screenshot of Motel Cinderella. I need to get a screenshot to uh, savor this this beautiful renovation. Of course, we've still got painting corner over there, just so we can exploit our guests. <laughs> But uh, I guess we're just going to get into it then. I guess we're going to jump in and see what happens. Oh, before I do, as a quick thank you to those of you who are watching my videos and just to show I appreciate you. Now, I don't normally like to do giveaways. Normally, I um, I think a lot of the time if you do giveaways, you you gain a lot of followers, but they tend to be people who aren't really there to support you. And sometimes those people are a little bit entitled. <laughs> Shh, don't tell them. Um, so uh, personally, I sometimes, um, it's not, I used to do it and then I kind of went, it wasn't my thing. But I thought, do you know what? People are watching my videos and supporting me. So I'm going to do this secretly. Well, it's not secretly. It's a first come, first served, right? So are you ready? Pen and paper at the ready. Sponsored by EA Game Changers. Thank you, EA Game Changers, for the code for this pack. Um, Go and get this code, go and put it in Origin, first come, first served, let me know if you get it, and uh, you don't have to let me know if you get it, but whoever gets it first, you know, good, well job, <laughs> well job. There you go, code for Dream Home Decorator. If you don't have it, get that code. If you're quick, if you get it in Origin, you've got a good chance, because only about 10 people watch my videos anyway, and put, most of you probably already have the pack. But uh, yeah, thank you to the Year Game Changers. Thank you to our favorite toddler guru, um, Simru Frost. Um, yeah, there you go. There's a code for you. Boom. Done. <laughs> Don't say I never give you anything. Uh, right. So let's 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 do some gameplay here. Let's let's test this out because I haven't given it a test drive yet. So there's probably going to be routine errors all over the place. Uh, right, Cinders. What are we doing with you today? I think we need to get you a gig. Uh, yeah, it's night time, so we probably do want to get you a gig for the morning. I'm going to save as well, just in case everything goes horribly wrong. Oh, look. Oh, it would have been good to do the land grabs. Uh, we've got fires, Vittore, free spirits. Um, Harris, who's that? Uh, wait, who's that? I Akiyama. Okay. I want to do... Ooh, I've not... Ooh, ooh. We could make a sexy bathroom, but I don't know who Harris is. Bathroom renovation. I, mm, I kind of want to do Vittore, but that's that's the gig that we've already done twice. That's kind of like the starter gig. Um, I kind of like the idea of doing a kitchen for the free spirits. This kitchen is so late 80s. Do you want to go so late 70s? Because that's the vibe I'm feeling right now at Motel Cinderella. Or is it early 90s? I can't tell. It just feels old to me. Feel called out, bitch. <laughs> you better take that back. Um, let's get cooking and spice things up with the kitchen renovation. Can you update it? Well, you've just offended me, so I'm going with fires. Love to get our bathroom renovated to be more spacious. Right now, it feels like we can't take a poop and wash my hands without even standing up. Am I reading this right? Okay, that doesn't sound like a bad thing, but it is. I feel like I can't breathe, and not just because of the poop. Help open up this bathroom for me. Sounds like a challenge. Challenge accepted. I can definitely open up that bathroom for you in so many ways. It's going to be so breezy. You're going to really enjoy it. Mm. Okay, so that is going on for tomorrow morning. So Dolly's just stood there. Do I have autonomy on? <laughs> is autonomy on? Did I just turn on? Is autonomy off for some reason? No, she has autonomy. Cinders, Cinders, do you want to do something? I mean, I can make you do something. <laughs> I can, can bully you into something. Ignore that. Um, yeah, okay, she's doing She's doing something. She's admiring the plant. She likes the plant. Uh, do you know what I think I could do is get a little bit more stuff on Plopsy here. Um, so uh, what do we have? These pictures oh that's a good one let's put that on plopsy put that on plopsy 
put that rubbish picture of a naked man on Plopsy. Let's just put it all on Plopsy. Let's do it. You know, balls to the wall here. <laughs> we need to pay back the mob. <laughs> so, um, yeah. They made me an offer I can't refuse. We still have um, a few problems in terms of like uh, hauntedness <laughs> that we're having to deal with, but the mother plant issue is dealt with now. You okay? Yeah. It's my son. He's off school this week. Um, so yeah, uh, no more tickle bomb vines. Um, they are fully dealt with because Knox befriended the mother and gave her an offer she couldn't refuse. He re re repotted her. <laughs> Do you repot the mother? <laughs> repotted her in into Silver Dorada. So uh, well done, Knox. Um, <laughs> hang on, let me just pause. <laughs> he wanted a hug but he had no pants on <laughs> like mother like son <laughs> so uh right i'm glad i paused um can't be bothered editing videos you see oh my goodness i'm too warm i'm too warm i can't cope look at nalani back in the pool as always she even eats a dinner in the pool look i provided you with chairs nalani you don't have to show off about being a mermaid all the time so do you know what i should do oh, how's Knox doing he's not doing great I should do what I always do, <laughs> take over the world. I should pinky him the brain this thing. Uh, oh, I forgot we got these cool shells. We could put them around as like decorations. We should do that. Let's do that. I want to do that. Just to make it a little bit more like beachy, you know, themed, a little bit more, a little bit more sexy in here, you know. <laughs> I don't know why shells are sexy, but I don't know. My guest told me they are, so that they are now. <laughs> that's what happened um this frog looks like it wants to go in here as well get out of the way nalani you need to pee why didn't you just pee in the pool is that are you too fancy now is the hotel too fancy for you you can't pee in the pool anymore fine um <laughs> i don't know why i'm angry about that um so i think i should probably get some more potions of plentiful needs shouldn't i um it's it's going for me <laughs> damn it um Spells copy paste stone. That's the one that I want to do. Um, I'm getting too warm. We're gonna have to put up with builders. <laughs> We're gonna have to put up with noisy builders. I'm sorry, guys. The singing now, which I quite enjoy. Um, so. <laughs> Maybe they want to be famous, they want to be stars, they want to be on YouTube videos where pe 10 people watch. Um, right, okay. Spells, copy pasto. Cool, cool. Let's stick those in our inventory. And maybe give Nox one of them because he's uh, a little bit sleepy. Oh no, he's up, he's up, he's happy. Right, okay, cool. Um, get get i've been watching this program today i can't think what it's called now it's like superstar or something like that it's on the bbc and it's about um it's a comedy and it's about this girl who uh she she gets really drunk in a pub one night and she gets off with this guy and it turns out she like gets up in the morning and she's kind of like looking for breakfast and she sees this big movie poster and she like turns the thing off and it's him he's like this it's like a notting hill but in reverse kind of thing but it's very cute um so yeah i've been binge watching that this morning it's really good i recommend it if anyone's looking for something to binge uh so noxy foxy noxy i can't believe it's taken us this long to get you a helper for your garden um you know get over here befriend this guy love the scarecrow examine the scarecrow and then probably chat with the scarecrow oh i wonder oh do you know what i wonder can we can we possess oh i want to possess the scarecrow that added creepiness can't do it never mind we tried uh chat with the scarecrow discuss the borbs burbs my daughter watches this video and it's like, this is a bob, this is a burb, this is a churkin. <laughs> so, makes me laugh. Um, okay, anything? Any reaction at all there, Knox? You're just staring, staring at his feathers, like admiring those feathers. He's like, he I, he knows, he's like, oh no, this, this, uh, this guy, he's going to break my heart. He's had his, poor Knox has had his heart broken so many times. First when Cinderella died and divorced him. And then that happened. 
<laughs> I don't know if you can hear that or not. And then, um, yeah, so... <laughs> Call 999, I think he's hurt himself. Um, tell Harvest jokes. Yeah, first one, Cinderella died and divorced him. And then, like, I don't know. He's, he's just a vulnerable guy, okay? And he's looking for love and he's like, Do you know, I'm, I know that I'm going to end up woohooing this guy in the dumpster, in the closet. Not in beds because that's too boring, and uh, you know he's gonna he's gonna cop off a of bone hilda or a guy and break my heart. So we know how this is gonna end. We know how this love story is gonna end before it's even started. Tell more, tell more harvest jokes. Makes discuss the birds more. Uh, what else? Uh, question: if Don't do that. That sounds rude. Uh, but do go and harvest the bizarre fruit because we do need to keep the the. Um, you know, I feel like. The bar is going to get the bar. The um, where are we? The hotel. The motel is going to get a popular place to hang out. You know, we're gonna, people are going to want to come and hang out at the lounge, hang out at the pool. You know, and see if they can uh, uh, get lucky. So um, I feel like it's going to be a popular place with people. And um, Gadri, <laughs> listen, why are you still creeping near the dumpsters? Should we just? Should we just do this? Should we just do this? No, because it's not going to let me. Um, Tell, tell him a dirty joke. <gasps> Become partners in crime. I want to do that. Mischief. Become partners in crime. Do it. You know, you're going to need... Listen, Cinderella, you've already... <laughs> like, you, you know, you just got out of your, your commitment to the mother plant. And now you've, you've kind of, like, <laughs> enmeshed yourself with the mob. So, you know, maybe you do need, just like, a partner <laughs> in crime. Maybe we should get Cinderella to join the, the criminal career next. Uh, she's acquired the wellness. Oh, Ribby Maximus. Well done, Ribby. <laughs> that skeleton is going to enjoy those massages, recipes, <laughs> and, and, and uh, things. Yeah, that healthy lifestyle. He's going to love that. It's going to work wonders for him. Uh, Cinderella and Gaidri are now partners in crime. They can now plan pranks together and unleash their inner mischief. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I love it. 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 How do we do it? How do we do it? Dare to jump? Jump, jump where? I mean, he's a ghost. He's not going to get hurt. Jump, like jump on the spot? Jump off the diving board? Where, where is he going to jump? Jump into bed with me? <laughs> Gary, don't mind if I do. 40 Batosa bar. I don't think he's jumping. <laughs> I don't think you listen to her. Passionate kiss. We we have to give him what he wants, right? Why is it not giving me interactions though? Why is it the dumpster's empty, right? So, but I don't. All the better to woohoo in more room, right? More space. As if as to wrap bacon around everything. What? Right, hang on. Here we go. Wait, 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 wait. wait. Die for, die for thrills. There we go. We found it. Priorities, right? Um, Noxy, Foxy, Woxy, Noxy. Uh, how are you doing? Why are your feet green? <laughs> Nox, are you okay, babes? Why are you, have you got socks on? What's happening there with you? I think the pool might need cleaning. That did not look healthy. <laughs> you know, the mob boss is not going to be impressed by this. Maybe we need to invite him over. It is 1.22 a.m. Is 1.22 a.m. a good time to invite the mob boss over? I'm not sure. Maybe we shouldn't do that. Are you not diving for... She's not diving for thrills. She's not doing it. Has anyone left any food around is my next question. We need to get more guests. I feel like a lot of the guests have left recently. And I don't love that about them. Ooh, what we do need to do is get more fizzy juice ready for the gig tomorrow. Um, so, Nox, if you could possibly get on that. Load ingredients. Uh, cinders. We're going to have to put some junk in our inventory because we know that our guests... Right, the, the two gigs that we've done, the two design gigs that we've done, we've left, like, trash and, like moldy food in the house and they loved it so i feel like that's the trick that's what we need to go for here uh just loads of bizarre fruit here you go avocado juice that sounds good too maybe we should try that one day <laughs> you, you've had avocado juice right it's like cucumber water it's, it's, it's good people enjoy it um right do it do the fizzing do it 
Stuart Knox, what do you have to do for your career? Maybe I should take things seriously. Logic skill. But how do I accomplish this without a normal size telescope? I could get a chess table, but he doesn't seem like a chess type, right? Does, um, does he have any logic skill? He does not. Uh, okay, I sense a problem occurring. I am, I am really sorry about those noises, guys. I don't know how loud they are for you. It's, it's, it is what it is. Um, just pretend, just pretend it's construction noises. Pretend that Motel Cinderella is still getting renovated, okay? It's, it's thematic, it's scenic, it's um, ambiance. Uh, we'll work, we'll make it work. You know, when life gives you drill noises, you make it work, you incorporate it into your story. C cinders. Magnific magnifico, perfection, mm, chef's kiss, uh, wonderful work there Cinderella. I'm a bit sad that we got rid of the pipe organ, but you know, the mob boss got the pipe organs, it's his thing now. Okay, it was Vlad's thing, then it was our thing. Yeah. It knocks his injury in this. <laughs> um, right, okay, I think I'm gonna, maybe I'm gonna wait until morning. Oh no, it's, we, we're getting close. Right, Cinders, maybe you need to take do you know what? We need to deal with these ghosts. We need to try and get the the um, the scariness level down, I think. Um, so drink that, Cinders. And then um, send spiritual fertility. Nox, I wonder if... Noxy, Foxy, Foxy, Noxy. I wonder if... Go and feed this bunny. And... Um, let's name it as well. I like to name them. Does this one have a name? No name cinnabon cute um is there anything that i can do that is gonna give him logic skill look you can blog about scientific findings write a scientific paper web that makes you focused i need logic I can't, why can't I do crosswords on, online? Sims team. Sim Guru Doi. Dumbledore. Why can't I do crosswords online? You know, get on that because that is uh, that's something that we need. Uh, Cinderella detects an angry presence lurking nearby. Sims on the lot need to be extra cautious. Spectres are angry and will scare nearby Sims. Paranormal activity is frequent. Right, well, in that case, you know what we have to do. Yes, yes, yes. No, yes. Yes. <laughs> That's what I'm going with. I want to try and get Knox to defriend. 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 Be was that Bonehild Bonehilda? Really? I just need more sexy underwear for Bonehilda. She's, you know, she's neglected. She's been wearing that for weeks now. It's filthy. Filthy. <laughs> she needs to clean her act up. Um, right, Noxy. Noxy, Noxy, Noxy. I think we probably need to plant some plants. Uh, chat with Scarecrow, make more small talk, talk, talk about the burbs again. Um, and then what can we plant? I've got quite a few avocados at this point. Let's just get some seeds. What? What's the date? What's the date here? So it's, we've got... Pug, Pugs of Tony Phil, Phil says it's going to be summer for weeks and weeks and weeks, okay? So maybe we need to plant some summer plants ready for summer. Uh, purchase seasonal seeds, seasonal summer plants, um, and maybe we'll get some spring plants as well, just because. There we go. Okay. So open these. Open. We've got lemons. <laughs> Life has literally given us lemons. <laughs> How bloody rude! Uh, I don't know what else it gave us there. Um, what do we have here? Starter flowers. I don't want to do flowers. Starter herbs. Maybe we want to get some herbs on the go here. All right, well, do you know, I guess we're planting a lemon tree. I like the cherries. Yeah, I could do some, you can do cherries. Cherries is good. Plant that. The greenest of thumbs. Knox is flourishing as much as his crop of germinating plant friends. Is this budding emotion a sign that he likes gardening? Do you know what do we think, guys? Does Knox like gardening? I think he might. Yes, Knox likes gardening. So that's good. So he's going to get fun now when he does gardening. So I like that. 
Yes, enjoy it. I want these cherry trees. Uh, let's space out the trees. Bob them. Oh, hello. <laughs> the mother plant has arrived. Uh, let's plant the cherry trees there. Um, and what's this like? Spinach? Basil. Basil, if you're from America. If you're from America, you plant some basil. Uh, so there you go. Just just one will be fine. Thank you. Did I tell him to eat it? Don't eat it. Plant it. Um, tr Mary Berry, Tree of Emotions, maybe. Bananas. Um, uh, maybe some more carrots. Carrot, carrot. <laughs> I feel like avocados are quite trendy. Maybe an avocado tree is the way to go. Um, here we go. Freesh avocado. Done. Okay, I hope that was entertaining for you, me agonising with my Libra brain about which crops to plant and probably planting all the wrong ones. Uh, yeah, I don't want to open the start of flowers yet. But what I reckon we can do is probably... Yes, this is done. So we've got the... Um, We've got the stuff that we need to do the gig. I'm actually going to save it. So save as Motel Cinderella building. <laughs> there we go. I'm going to save it before the gig starts. So hopefully the gig won't get corrupted. I did have a mod issue. Um, it turned out for anyone who's having problems, it actually turned out to be, and I was shocked um, because I thought it was going to be one of my mods, but it was... Um, MC Command Center. If you adjust the time, um, uh, because I like to slow down time, I like to, to extend the hours in the day, um, and it mucks up a load of things, and it was mucking up gigs. So um, I've, I've reset it to like the, the default setting, and it's fine now. So uh, yeah, thanks to the person who helped me out with that. Um, yes, call it. Uh, no, it's um, um, Happy New House. Juice. Happy new house juice. Yeah, they'll definitely drink that. <laughs> so many people are going to get infected with the mother. It's going to be amazing. Um, right, what else can we do? We've got all this stuff. Um, oh, yeah, we want this. Look, we want that and we want this. Oh, it's so stinky. They're going to love it. Okay, Cinders, how are you actually doing? Because you do have to go soon. I think what you should do with your time is knit something that we can put in the house. So knit, please. Um, what are you knitting? What are you currently knitting? Uh, no, uh, knit objects. Let's knit them. Let's knit them a rug. Uh, that's pretty cool. Uh, I don't know what colours they're gonna like though. It's so di so di so difficult. It's a bathroom. Maybe this dark green rug. Maybe they'll like teal. It's called teal Slim's tea. Bloody dark green. Uh, <laughs> I don't know why I'm aggressive about colours. Oh, look at them all! Oh, look at it! They're enjoying themselves! There's <laughs> more food on the floor. Nabbit cinders. Don't vacuum it. Put it Put it in your inventory. Uh, everybody's doing pretty well, aren't they? Like, I'm, pre I'm quite impressed with us. You know, we're making progress now. It's been a dump for so long. Uh, Ruby has finished creating a carton of vanilla ice cream. The carton has been added to their inventory. Well job, Ruby. Going to enjoy that. Uh, so you're probably off to work soon, aren't you? Harvest, har yeah, it's logic skill. I don't know what to do about that. Uh, ben Hilda and uh, Ruby are just chilling, which is fine. Uh, hopefully they're just going <laughs> to... I mean, we've got an hour before work, haven't we? So get in. He's gone to sleep in there. <laughs> Seriously, seriously, Gaidri, Gaidri, wake up, honey. <laughs> Why are you even tired? You're a ghost. You don't have a body to physically get tired. Um, what are you doing, Cinders? Oh, yeah, knitting. I remember telling this to knit now. <laughs> Look at this chaos. It's like, um, oh, what's the movie? Let's do the time walk again. Rocky Horror Show, Rocky Horror Picture Show. Bone Hilda there in a sexy clothing. <laughs> Skeleton wandering around. I know there's no skeletons in it, but it's like spooky, right? Um, just mental. Mental, mental. Uh, talking about bats? Yeah, okay, bats and frogs. Mm -hmm. Yeah, interesting conversation, not I'm sure Ribby's enjoying this. <laughs> Bone Hilda's just thinking about her food there. Same girl, same. Yeah, justice for Bone Hilda. You know, she's. She's not, she's, she's always been sexy, right, in that little maid outfit, but I feel like, 
you know, now that she's made of flesh again, I feel like she needs a more range of, of uh, sexy underwear. I really do. <gasps> Lord and Savior, it's on belly. Cancel everything. Cancel everything. Cancel everything. Cinderella. Cinderella. Listen. Cinderella. Listen. Thorn Bailey, Thorn Bailey, Thorn Bailey, Lord and Saviour Thorn Bailey. Hello, I have a job to do soon, so please, um, 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 asking for a hug maybe? Because why doesn't he love us yet? We're trying so hard with him. Because we're not famous. Voting is now open. Cind right, good, it's working. Cinderella has a decorated gig in one hour. It gets the clients lots on time. Cool, okay. Ebony. Oh. So Bailey, we love you. Why? Don't be scared. Don't be scared. Okay, don't be scared. Let's just keep trying it. You never know. <laughs> it's not looking positive, is it? He's not into it. He's scared. <laughs> He's like, I've been here before. Listen, I don't. Why does he keep coming around though? Why does he keep coming around? Asking for another autograph. Let's see if we can get a bigger one. Yeah, free love. Give us, love us, Thorn Bailey. Thorn Bailey, love us, love us, Thorn Bailey. Um. What can we do? What can we do? Minion eyes. Minion eyes, Thorn Bailey. Will he go small and yellow and go banana? Right. Is he, is, is he under our kind Why can't we woohoo him? I mean, that would be bad, right? That would be bad. There's been a conversation in the Sims community about these kind of things already. And I feel like, yeah, let's, uh, let's, uh, let's not do that <laughs> but love us thorn bailey i guess we can just make him clean it's fine right it's fine <sighs> not you judith uh are you are you leaving thorn bailey are you seriously leaving it's fine we're leaving too <laughs> we were like, we were just leaving thorn bailey it's like oh not a good time for us right let's go to work right okay Design skills need to. Am I sweaty? <laughs> it's been just revealing like big sweaty bits to you all. Oh, feel sweaty. I've got really sore shoulders as well at the moment. I need a massage. Who wants to come today at Motel Cinderella and give me a massage? Because I need one. Um, right, okay. Quiet the juice fizzing skill. Ribby Maximus, well done, Ribby. Um, is that autonomous? I didn't realise that was an autonomous thing. Right, okay. Hello. Hi. Nice to meet you. Oh, yeah. Cheerful introduction. Uh, funny introduction. Is she not a teenager? Young adult. I thought she was a teenager for some reason. She's a young adult in my game, but I, for some reason I thought she was a teenager. I think they want to come and stay at Motel Cinderella. I and mean, this is the aim. This is what we're planning for them. Uh, they have quite a nice house, don't they? In my in my main save, they they live completely completely differently. Um, Okay, let's let's go in. Can, can you can you let me can you let me in your house, please? I, I kind of need to go. I love that we've turned up in like in a bathing costume. I love that we've turned up in a swimsuit. Like you know, like I'm here. I have arrived. <laughs> what is this woman? Should we try and make her look a bit more professional, or are we just going with it? I mean, it's a warm day. Listen, if I could sit here. In my swimsuit and do the video without everybody absolutely hating me and calling me names. And like, I would do it, right? I won't. I won't do that to you. I won't. Like I want to. I want to strip off. I want to sit here in a baby's suit. It's that kind of day. Um, she's inside the house. Oh, okay. Come on in, right, girls. Oh, I'm gonna ask. Do you know who's gonna have the best taste? Morgan. Cheerful introduction. How do we not know Morgan yet? Oh, she's a teen. Why is she the teen? Oh, what a woohooer. Fine, I'll behave. I won't flirt with the teenager. That'd be weird. I get it. Yeah, I thought I thought she, I thought she was a teen and she was a teenager. I got it the wrong way around. Um, discuss designs. But you know, Morgan is going to be the one with all the taste here. Talk about previous projects. <laughs> Do you like bowling alleys? Ask to see mood board. Well, let's get this show on the road. I know what I'm doing now. Um, I love that they talk about poop so much. Do you like gold sinks? Do you like colour swatches? 
Come on, give me the information. We've got four things as well. So they like Queen Anne. Not the look I was going to go for. I don't mind Queen Anne as, as a decor, but I think most of it is base game, which I don't think it has as much polys. It's not as detailed, right? It's like the newer content. So I, I feel like we need an update to that. Right, you don't want a, you don't want an oven in your bathroom, okay? Note taken. You don't want to you don't want to you don't want to eat where you poop. Fine, okay. Got the point. Um, like suburban contempo. Dislike suburban contempo decor. Do you? Really? Ask to see inspirations. Again, remember, we're trying to make everybody very uncomfortable so that they come and stay at Motel Cinderella instead. So, that is pretty cool. Weird squeaky noise. Um, okay, we, we need one more. Anything else that you like? Can we... Can we specifically ask what their favourite colour is? Is that a thing? I feel like that's a thing now. Ask about favourite colour. Do you like blue? She does like blue. Right. Oh, she likes the colour blue, but we don't have that as a like. Okay, so what else can we ask? Show portfolio? Come on, give us the information. Right, here we go. She likes snowboarding. Okay. Snowboarding themed bathroom it is. Okay, where is the bathroom that we're redecorating then? Uh, this one? Okay, let's go here and uh, take before photos. Come on. Up the stairs you go, Cinderella. Right, so. Currently, this is the bathroom. Uh, let's I think we can float around ah, we can float around oh my god that wall is not even tiled they absolutely need our help this is ridiculous my goodness they need our help so badly there's not even anything in that corner that's just like a blank space like oh my goodness right I absolutely they need our help so much right enter build mode and make renovations so we have to send the clients away first though where are they Oh my god, I'm still on speed three. No, <laughs> I'll, I'll run out of time. Like, go away. <laughs> and a snap. Send clients away. Ready? Stop talking and go. Why are you flirty? I like that she turned the TV off before she left. <laughs> Very responsible, Morgan. I didn't know that about you. Okay, here we go. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Right, so she likes snowboarding. So I feel like we need to filter for uh, a snowy escape. Uh, oh, look at this, right, okay. And she likes blue, okay. Can't we stick it on the wall? Oh, damn it, I thought we could like hang it up on the wall. Right, this is, this is what we're theming the bathroom. Why is that locked? Oh, because it's the thing you want, okay, fine. Um, None of the others are particularly blue, though. Like, that's, like, blue and orange. Do they want a blue and orange Queen Anne bathroom with a touch of... with a touch of... <laughs> oven? Um, all right, we're, we're into it. We're, we're doing this. This is what we're doing. So, let's get a nice... We need orange and blue. Let's filter for orange and blue. Orange, blue, cool. So we'll do the bathroom like, what tiles do we have available? Uh, oh, this one, right, cool. Oh, look at that, that is perfect, perfect. Okay, so then let's get rid of, I don't know how much money we have, I didn't really pay attention to that. <laughs> I didn't really pay attention to the budget, you know, who has a towel over the toilet? Um, that's the wrong colour. That's poop. Get rid of that. Right, cool. Let's get the little saucer lights that everybody loves. I love that they size those down like for us. That was a really good idea. What's this? What's happening here? Oh, because it's showing me all the different colours. Okay, I see what I see what's happening now. Um, oh, do I not have the saucer light? Yes, I do. Okay, here it is. Look, subtle saucer light. Cool. 
Um, right, definitely keeping the thing. Right, I, I know that they have these nice windows, but can we... They said that they wanted it to be, like, breezy. So I'm just going to give the client what they want. All right, cool. And then um, what bathroom stuff do we have? Like, nothing? What's going on here? So they need a new sink. I love this sink. They'll love it too. And uh, they need a new toilet. Uh, I think they could, I'm going to put the toilet right next to the oven because I feel like... You know, that is going to be enjoyable for them. I'm going to give them, give them cat litter. <laughs> Do you know, it, we're, we're artists. We're artists. Ah, that one. That one works, right? I like that one. And um, uh, they need a new shower bath combo thing. I really like that one, actually. Oh, but I like that one with the whale on. I feel like she likes exploring new things, right? So we'll put that. We'll put this heat. Where should we put that? there so they can just you know if it smells too much like poo they can just get on the, the snowboard and slide right out of there you know like with this is the kind of thing that we're thinking about can we put a spandrel in though we can put a spandrel in. there we go okay so it makes it look more like it's a big open window right rather than just like a hole in the wall <laughs> beautiful they're gonna love it they're gonna absolutely love it um i think we've got that rug in our inventory right what else do you need in the bathroom um some kind of mirror this one with cats on. oh no it should be orange just to keep just to keep with the kind of like the orange theme as well all right i think we're more or less done um maybe oh this little washing basket's cute we can put that in there uh we're doing well with the budget i think we're actually saving the money at this point um let's put a uh, little towel there for them. Um, doesn't look like we've got toilet roll. Hold on a sec, guys. Are we good? Am I recording? I am recording. Okay, back to designing this beautiful, beautiful bathroom. Um, that's cute as well. Like, yeah, right over the oven. Yes, beautiful. And an ironing board. <laughs> I don't know why. Just because it's blue, I like it. And uh, probably one of these things as well, like, uh, it doesn't really fit though, does it? Yeah, right, okay, we're not having that. Uh, right, cool, I think we've done quite well. You know, this as well, for just in case they get any poo, poo in, you know, on the floor or on the oven, they can like sweep it up, be, that'll be good. Yeah, I think they're gonna like this. I think we've done a really nice job here. I think we've really listened to the client's needs and, uh, oh, a light, we need a new light. Um, boop, 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 boop. Um, and then we're going to have, what do we want here? What's this? Season's greeting. Beautiful. Oh, it's gorgeous. All right. Let's go back into live mode. Live mode or live mode? Hmm. I feel like I've just annoyed like 50% of you. That, right. Hello? Uh, we'll put that there just so they see right when they walk in that we've given them a gift. Um, do we have the rug? Did we finish knitting it? We can give them a picture of Thorn Bailey. Do you know what? We're generous. We are generous. We're going to do it right over. Oh, I wish I could go back into build mode. I was going to turn the bathroom right over the toilet with, this, with the picture of Thorn Bailey. Like, yes, yeah, it's perfect. Love it. Gorgeous. Um, so, you know, Thorn Bailey can watch them poop. Um, what else can we give them? Uh, food, right? Because we want to get them started. So a bit of food there and uh, yeah, a little bit of trash as well, just to remind them of who's decorated. It's our thing, right? I said we, we need a, a unique USP and uh, putting trash around is our unique USP. Don't judge me. Did we not knit the... Cinderella, could you just do that really quickly? Could you finish doing what I've asked you to do for a change? I just love that she's just in their bedroom. Um, do we want to enable Shane as well? I feel like we do. So let's finish the, this is taking a long time. That might be how we get the logic skill for um, for Knox. If we get him to drink loads of Gydra juice, if we get him to just knock that stuff back like oysters, that's how he's gonna, right, okay. Ooh, pause, pause, pause. Okay, I don't know how long this is taking. It's probably taking far too long. I don't know if there's like a time limit. Uh, 
We need to be done by 9 p.m. Friday. Okay, that's fine. Um, I'll stop talking about gouger juice. There we go. It's green. It doesn't match, but we, it's got that personal touch, right? Like, no, oh, I need to keep that. We might need that for more, more potion stuff. I think that's beautiful. I forgot I had a lightsaber. We're going to have to go back to Batu. I like it. <laughs> I don't know what you're all complaining about. Um, right. She's going to drink some Gydra juice. Okay. Cinders. Can you drink it quickly? Because we need to call call the clients back. Um, she's got the fabrication skill now. Um, Why not? You know? Again, a personal touch here. You're not going to get this kind of service from anyone else. Oh, I want to join the... Wait! Oh, <gasps> Mortimer's inviting me back into my own gang. Hey, Cinderella, we'd love you to join the Scooby gang. What do you think? Yes! Yes! I'm so happy to be back. Okay, we've given them a little ghost buddy as well. So I feel like we're doing super well. We've been accepted into the Scooby gang. This is amazing! It's amazing. Like, yes, dream come true <laughs> to be invited back into my own thing. How do I get people back? Did I do it? Did I invite them back? I can't remember what I am and I'm not doing right now. Uh, take, oh, I need to take after, after photos. Yeah, I remember now. Uh, go here, interior decorator, take after photos. Oh, it's so good. So good. Like, I actually genuinely think that is an improvement. Like, not, not joking, because it's, do you know what? It's just more unique. Maybe, may, all right, fair enough. Maybe not the, the, the old food, but like, this is nice. They've got nice tiles. It's got, definitely got more character, you know? Don't know if it suits the build, but I actually think that's quite bright. I actually quite like that. I mean, I may incorporate that more when I build legitimately. I know you think I'm joking, but I'm actually not. She's having a, she's Chris. Don't flush it. Don't flush it. Do not flush it. Don't you dare flush it. Please be pooing. Please be pooing. You're taking a long time on there, so I think you're probably pooing. Don't flush it. <laughs> okay, this is great. This is great. Just to show them that even though there's a poo in the toilet, you can barely smell it, right? <laughs> we thought about this. She's getting tired. <sighs> I don't know what I'm doing anymore. Right. Right. Wait. We need to... Concentrate on what you're doing, Cinderella. Take after photos, please. I like that you can take before photos when you're done. Look at, look at the state of this thing. It's so good. It's so good. Okay. <laughs> can I get inside the toilet? I don't know what my hand was doing then. Oh, there's no poo in there. That's a shame. Just we'll really get those like design details down there. Okay, cool. <laughs> Done a good job, I feel. Um, right, okay. Excuse me. Um we need to call them back. How do we do how do we do this? <laughs> it's been it's been a few days since I played. I can't remember. Call clients to lot. I've been poorly, leave me alone. Right, okay, and then we can right, okay. Oh, 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 okay. Uh, this one and this one, this one and this one, and this one and this one. I mean, that's an improvement. They literally had nothing in that corner. Look how more interesting that is now. I really do genuinely think we've done a good job. Uh, right, Sh Shane, begin recording. Record me, Shane. Record the big reveal. British Rail runs on rusty red rails regularly. Where are they? Where are they? Where, 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 where are they? Call clients a lot. What am I doing out here? Why am I out here in my bikini? Yes, host the event. Love that. Love that for them. I love that when they coded that, when they were like, okay, spawn people in. They've clearly said, spawn people in on the target sim. I'm quite sure because I've done this myself. You can say at a distance of like one or two tiles. <laughs> like you can actually set the distance, but they said no spawn them in directly on the sim <laughs> nice nice decision making there <laughs> sims team like it, it amuses me please don't change it um that is that is not a face that is not a face that trusts us is it 
<laughs> no, it's like not a happy face. She's like, okay, she's like, look, I'm looking up at the house here. I'm looking up at the house and I can already see she's made some interesting changes. <laughs> she's, she's... <gasps> it's a big window. You said you didn't like the smell of poo. All right, they're all running over. They're all eager beavers. All right. I love that they all line up as well. They're going in. Kind of like, they're just they're just doing this themselves today. They're not even like lining up and getting excited. All right, I guess I have to show them stuff, right? Show show. Um, I can't. Sh why can't I show Morgan the surfboard? That sucks. Why can't I show them anything? What's going on here? Wait, what's happening? Is it bugged? What's happening? Oh, they've gone to, right, they've gone to the back of the lot. Okay, that's why. So yeah, she's definitely nervous, does not trust us whatsoever. He's pretty casual about it. He's like, I didn't give any she, Oh, she's so pretty. Oh, yep, yeah, Shane, get a close up of her. She's she's pretty. People will enjoy that content. Um, right, so reveal renovations to client. To be fair, she's not a teen in my game, she's an adult. <laughs> so I'm allowed to crush on her when she's in my, my main save. Um, right, okay. I know it's creepy right now. <laughs> Stop it. Stop it. I'm used to thinking of her as an adult. And basically, most of the teens in my save have now aged up to adults. And they have been for a while because I've been getting everybody through uni. So it's a whole thing. Uh, right, okay. Off we go. Yeah, you cover your eyes. You probably do want to cover your eyes, actually, because you're following Cinderella up the stairs and she's not wearing much. Wait, I didn't know I was recording a video. Uh, open air bathroom reno. Uh, no need to worry about that. Poop I left in the toilet. Beautiful. Everybody's going to watch that. <laughs> it's going to be on like OnlyFans or something, that one. Um, right, okay. Do you like the oven? Do you like the oven now? Do you... Oh, here we go. Razzle dazzle -oom. Do you know, it was so plain before and now it's got character. I stand by my design choices. <laughs> I gave them what they wanted. <laughs> I love the picture of Thor Bailey over the toilet. All right, perfect, perfect. <laughs> oh hi. Um, I, can you bring in a stream instead? Because that's kind of actually what I meant to click on. Um, check this out. I stop with that. Sh Shane, Shane, stop. Where's it gone? Why can you go through walls now? Why is that a thing? Check this out. Check. Check this out. Oh, she can't do that. Uh, check out. What else do we want her to check out? Maybe let's not show her the oven. Check out this cat thing. No, we want to show her blue. She likes blue. Check this out. Check this out. Sing in the shower. Can we get away with it, do you think? Or are they going to kick us out if we do that? What gets you kicked out? Well, I don't know what gets you kicked out, but I'm willing to try it. I'm willing to investigate this. Okay. Here we go. Show off objects. We need to do that three times. It says up here behind my head. Chat with clients. Uh, complain about problems. Remember how everything's not like poo? And you didn't like that? I didn't like that either. Argue about dirty surroundings. Uh, uh, debate, debate existence of vampires. That's that seems appropriate. Um, uh, sw rave about favorite singers. Discuss dance techniques. All just things that aren't. <laughs> I think I've seen enough. Let's go over my thoughts. Okay, fine. What does she think? Does she like it? She does like it. She's got a tick over her head. Uh, the renovation turned out so well that I figured, why stop here? I hope you work with me again on the next job. She likes it. They're not supposed to like it. I wish I had that many followers. <laughs> like on the, I mean, I do on Twitter, not on YouTube, though. Um, 
But not people who are just here for the codes. You can get out. <laughs> you have to actually enjoy my content. Or hate watch. That's also acceptable. Because I find that funny. Uh, Cinderella has been offered a gig from a previous client. Returning customers bode well for her per professional reputation. Nice. It, <laughs> it might not be what, I, what was asked for. But I like it. Definitely appreciate the effort. <laughs> Thanks. Thank you. Right, what are you what are you doing? Can you please look at things? Check this check this out. Look, I need to. I have needs. I have needs. And my needs are not being met here. Okay, okay, she's ready. He's ready. Right, they're all ready. Okay, cool. Where are they all then? Why are you, why are you going downstairs? You, do you expect me to chase you? Could you just just stay in the bathroom, please? Could could someone please you know what I need to do? You know what I need to do? I need to literally gift it to her. Like put it in her hands. Have a new house juice. It might not be what I asked for. <laughs> yeah, I didn't really care about what you wanted. <laughs> I mean, you did ask. Oh, she's completed the gig. Okay, apparently I just had to talk to two people. Oh, professional reputation dropped significantly. I didn't do that badly. I feel like that is a bit harsh. And she's earned no money. Oh, because it's 9 p.m. because I didn't complete the job. Oh. End stream. So I, I can't complete it, it's gone. Oh, I need to do it faster next time. That's a shame. There's no accounting for taste, but then maybe it's just the client's taste and not and, and not yours and yours don't match. Okay. Well, let's put, let's put that back in our inventory. And do you know what? If you're not gonna pay us for this glorious work, then I'm gonna sing in your shower. That's what I'm gonna do. Sing in your shower. Listen, other people like my renovation. Other people like my renovation. And now, like, just... That's what I think of you guys. That is what I think of you. Let's go home. Oh, disappointed. Really disappointed. Got my reputation. <laughs> oh, it's a hard Cinderella life for us. I hear you've been building your magical prowess. Would you like to put it to the test? Why not? Why not? Do you know what? I need to get this anger out of my system somehow. Because that was that was not fair. I was very professional. And I did give them what they asked for. And I just happened to run out of time. Because they all wandered off. If I hadn't go, had to go chasing them around the house. Maybe. Maybe I would have completed it on time. They did that on purpose. I'm telling you. <laughs> Fake angry. Uh, right, okay. To the dueling rounds. I didn't know she was a witch. Maybe I did know she was a witch. She's does she still live with us? Discuss overcharge risks. I do feel like we need to warn her about those. Right, and then I guess we duel her at the dueling grounds. Where, where did she? Where is she? Right, I guess we have to go to the dueling grounds then, right? Where is the dueling grounds? Not there. Not there. Up there? Here we go. Okay, is, is she already up there? Go here together. This is going to be a really long video. I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> Where is she? Where is she? Where is she? Where is she? <laughs> sorry, I can't say that without doing a bad man impression. Where is she? Where, where is she, though? More. She invited me here, and now she's not here. Is she not even like in a group with me? <sighs> Why is it so hard? Why is this my life? Why is this my life? Well... <laughs> I mean, he's not going to teach me anything, is he? Because he doesn't like me. 
I do have that problem. Where's Isabel? Isabel Santelier, are you down here? Is that her there? Isabel, Isabel, she's going upstairs. Isabel, Isabel, Isabel. Listen, it's been a long video. I'm teleporting. I'm a witch. I can do that. Why is she running? Why, Isabel? Why, 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 why are you running, Isabel? What, what has frightened you? Tell me. I'll protect you. Um, 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 magic. Asked to teach a, teach ultimate mischief spell. Oh my God. What is that? I need it. Isabel, we listen, girl, we're friends. Like, why are we not that good friends anymore? We were really good friends for a while. No, you, Isabel, listen. Listen, Isabel. Listen. I need the ultimate mischief spell. I, like, I need that. You don't understand, Isabel. Listen, I've had a bad day. Do me this favor. I know you, I know that you're my bae. I know that you... <gasps> she just gave it me. She just, like... She just, she just gave it me. She just gave it me. Right, oh my gosh, she's such a legend. Uh, uh, what else can I do? Ask to teach, teach me more mischief magic. I need it, honey. Wait, what's that? What did, what did I do? Strangeify. Where is it? Make a sim appear repulsive to everyone around them. That's a bit mean, isn't it? Okay. Thanks, babes. Let's go home. Who can we use this on? I'm excited. Do you know? You know who we need to use this on, guys. You know who we need to use this on. You know what has to happen here. It's obvious. It's, it's, listen. They didn't just not pay us for a job well done. They didn't just not pay us for a job well done. They disgraced our reputation. You know, they smeared our name all over town. And I think revenge is justified in this case, quite frankly. Now, normally I say don't do revenge. It's bad karma, but, but it's the Sims. It's the Sims. It's not real. And, uh... Where are they? Not you, Morgan, I like you. Moira. Siobhan. Dominic. Get your butts over here. They had it coming. They had it coming. They're all sleeping. Oh, for crying out loud. <sighs> Give me a minute, guys. Give me a minute. Give me a minute here. <laughs> All right, okay, they're coming over. You can see up here, they are on their way. I don't have much time. Here they are, look, here they are. Look, 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 look. Ah. <laughs> All these scary ghosts are around as well. I thought we'd try to make them less scary. Yeah, you should be scared. You don't know what you're in for here, guys. Spells, strangeify, do it. Where is she gone? Are you doing it, Cinderella? What are you doing? Strange effect. Do it. What? Has, she, has she done it? Oh, oh, she did it. Oh, she did it. Oh, dear. Oh, no. <laughs> Poor. Mo Listen, this is what happens if you don't, uh, you know, this is just karma coming back to you. You. you you destroyed my reputation and now you're kind of, you've gone all Shrek. I mean, yeah, you know, you should be scared. You should be scared, dude, because it's going to happen to you as well. Try to console. No, no, no consolation here. No consolation prizes. You better invite me back to your house and give me another job because, uh, because, uh, listen, I'm friends with the mob, the mob now, so <laughs> I'm joking. I'm being silly. Be nice in real life. Just let it go, let it flow, right? <laughs> but in The Sims. In The Sims. Listen, I tried my best with that. I mean, it's not even their fault that I ran out of time, but, but things are on fire. Things are on This is, <laughs> what is this episode? This is, why are there so many red things? What? Oh my God, it's chaos, it's chaos.
It's chaos. It's chaos. Uh, can I put that out? Can I? Can I... Call the fire department. <laughs> this is just absolute like madness. Like. <laughs> Oh, it just gets weirder and weirder here, doesn't it? It really does. Right, I'm leaving it there because we've got a design gig in half an hour, which will be a brilliant place to start the next episode, I promise. Uh, so I'm leaving it there. I hope you've enjoyed. Uh, do do let me know if you got that code. Um, exciting. Um, and uh, yeah, leave me a like, subscribe, hit that notification bell, all that business, and I'll see you again soon, guys. I hope you've enjoyed. Bye-bye. Don't Revenge is bad. Don't revenge.